Meantime, a Polk County Middle School community in mourning this morning. The assistant principal and a teacher at Lake Gibson Middle School victims in a double murder suicide happening in Brandon. Many students and fellow staff members are just learning about that tragedy. And now, News Channel 8's Chip Osowski in Lakeland with the new details of this troubling case. All is quiet here at Lake Gibson Middle School in Lakeland. The school district issuing a statement saying, in part, it's difficult to put this loss into words. 39 year old Samara Rautenberg was an assistant principal at the school. 51 year old Lisa Fillerot was a math teacher. She was one of the teachers who, if I could be a, a fraction of the teacher that she, she was, um, I would, it would be amazing. I caught up with Cassie Bussey, one of Philorot's former students. She believes Philorot energized and inspired her to fulfill her dream of becoming a teacher herself. She was just a teacher who made math fun, who made math interesting, who took the time if you were struggling to help you get to where you needed to be. Um, it, I was always excited to go to her class. She was one of my favorite teachers in sixth grade. Bussy just learned Fillerot and her girlfriend Samara Rautenberg were killed by Fillerot's estranged husband Vincent before taking his own life. He was seen exiting the vehicle with a shotgun. He then proceeds to the rear of the residence and enters the back porch. At that point, we can't see anything else on surveillance. But what we believe is he made entry to the house. The victims became aware at some point. They both armed themselves with firearms. Despite their efforts, both women died. Investigators revealing Vincent Fillerot was already on probation for attacking his wife's new interest once before. The females were both concerned, and that's why I believe they got the firearms because of the past incident and his anger. Flowers now sit in front of the school, cards offering prayers for the victim's families. Bussy, like many, expressing disappointment over such a senseless loss. It, it breaks my heart. It breaks my heart for all the sixth graders coming up. My, my fourth graders are going to be here in two years, and they're not going to be able to have her. The district went on to say that it will have grief counselors on hand first thing Monday morning for any staff member or student who needs someone to talk to. In Lakeland, I'm Chip Osowski, News Channel 8.